We're back in LA. I'm back. Phil's back. We got Nate on FaceTime as we tend to. We got a bucket full of product. I don't know what the fuck's in here, to be honest with you. Some of it's like three weeks old. Matan put some of it in here. So you're gonna get my genuine reactions. This is like a true YouTube unboxing video. Follow us on YouTube. Me and Nate are like the white and black blazendary, or maybe like Blake Linder. I know you guys want the LA planning video. We're not there yet. I will say that I have a plan. Once we launch LootCoin and really scale it up and get it to like a $10 billion market cap, I'm gonna use that money to fund my campaign. I have a goal of being the world's first bi-coastal city councilman. I wanna be on the city council in both New York and LA at the same time. I feel like that's illegal. I think it's illegal to be this tapped in with so many different communities and so many different people. It should be illegal, it's not. So I think I have a unique perspective. Vote for me for both. But we're getting back to food. We're gonna talk about the most important section of any menu, appetizers. Many times you can make your entire meal from just appetizers. Most of the best shit on most menus is on the appetizer menu. Entrees seem like bullshit. Do you think that appetizers are just like American tapas? <laughs> You know, I, I would if a plate of nachos didn't have 4,500 calories and it's like the size of a fucking platter. Like, you know, the, the nachos of the Commodore, you would be remiss calling those an appetizer. Sitting back and actually thinking about it, an appetizer, like eating a fried thing before you eat an entree is the most like fat ass shit ever. And it's a stupid idea, but all the good shit's on there. We'll get into it, we'll get into it. Let's start with the product. Red Pyrex shorts. What's the new Cardi song called? It's not a whole lot of red. It's like all red or I don't know. These with the backwards Houston Rockets jersey, movie. We got the human made like polo rip pants. These shits are really cool. I don't love human made. Um, the Nike Nego shit is awful but this is cool. We got the Yo Gabba Gabba Hit a Lick mask. What kind of crime are we committing in the Yo Gabba Gabba? A crime of passion. Oh shit, this is hard. Capital, I think. Yeah, we got the like freaky kind of, it's probably gonna fuck the mic up. Uh, Celine uh, Leopard Stompers. These got real like uh, strokes listener energy to them. Vintage racing jacket, this is cool. Marlboro, shout out Virginia, man. Bring back big tobacco. Balenciaga uh, metal logo shirt, <laughs> big ol', like a smock kind of. We got a special guest, Adam Feynman, with the Prodigy shirt on. What's up? What do you think about this? It's cool. That's all you got? Vetmont hat, that's all I got for you. Looks like I'll call you back out in a sec. Cause original fake Gore-Tex jacket with the chompers. This shit had round two and round two hangers on in a chokehold in 2014, let me tell you. Last but not least, we got the Sean Crawford Arcteryx hand done. Not the good color, but it is a color. All right, appetizers. Like I said, best part of the menu. All the shit you really want is on the app menu. Also, when I'm talking apps, I'm talking like sports bars, bars, chain restaurants. I don't give a fuck about the apps like Odeon. And so the statement I'm about to make is I'm prefacing that because, you know, when I go to like a, a chain restaurant, like I don't really give a fuck about the burger or like the entree. It's all about the apps, like the wings, nachos, potato skins, app sampler, Southwest egg rolls, lots to chew on, literally. But like all the bangers are on there. All the like entrees are kind of like second thoughts, you know? I think a good way to think of apps is like, would this be delicious dipped in ranch? Most apps that I want are delicious dipped in something better, whether it's a queso, whether it's a ranch, whether it's something, you know, something of the ilk. I gotta ask, what place has the best appetizers to you? Our favorite wing place that I'm not gonna mention has good apps because they got the cheese fries. I like Outback a lot because they got the onion, they got the cheese fries, they got the bread, they got, you know, they got wings if you want some bullshit Outback wings. At that point, I don't, I've already eaten 4,500 4, calories. I don't need a fucking steak, you know, like maybe I need some protein. Chili's has bangers, Southwest egg rolls. They have like Memphis hot chicken flavored cheese sticks now, which is crazy and like, uh, you know, an affront against nature, but they got that shit. I think, I think Shane's got the best apps. Like, let's say you're on like a desert island or you're being executed. What is like the one app that you would- Well, I think we should do it under being executed because the app that I want has very little nutritional value, so it wouldn't sustain me on a desert island. I would get scurvy extremely quickly. Cheese fries, baby. Fries with like, not queso, but like a melted cheese blend, put under the salamander, maybe some bacon on there, maybe some pickled jalapenos with the side of like a good ranch. Seed oil maxin. Nate brought up earlier, I don't know if he's gonna bring it back up because he's in a deeply hungover state and he may not remember saying this, but he hates when you get like an odd number of an appetizer when they give you like three of one thing or like five of one thing, it makes it hard to split because truly the best way to eat with friends is to go and order a bunch of shit and split it all. Only ordering one thing and not sharing it seems like it's not what our, 
our tribe mentality was built upon. Humans are social animals. I've spoken about this before. But then again, like thinking back on it, it's like the strong will survive. Like you and your, your brother fighting over like- The third mozzarella stick? Is that a metaphor for like the human condition? <laughs> I always got my hungry eyes in the last one, but I don't want to seem too fat, so I never go for it. I like fried appetizers. Also, like, we're getting salads and shit. I love a good Caesar. You like a good Caesar. There's the appetizer course, then there's the salad course. That's a separate course. And one that I could skip most of the time, yes. <laughs> Do we have anything else here? <laughs> All right. This product video is just the appetizer. The entree is the product we upload every single day on Instagram and the website. Luke's.store, anything else? <laughs> follow Nate, bro, follow Nate. He only got like a thousand followers, it's crazy. That's fucking crazy. I'ma add him as a collaborator in this video. Y'all need to follow him, that's crazy.